Hamilton was going to go in the second half, and what do you think about how he handled that situation? Oh, uh, like, me and JT go together all the time in practice, you know what I'm saying? Like, so when I found out he was going in, I was just went over there to support him and tell him, like, we got your back. Like, you've been ready for this, you know what I'm saying? He didn't practice hard. He takes all his two reps like he's a one. So we had no worries about that at all. And I think he played great, you know what I'm saying? I think he came in and delivered and got us the victory. And that's all that matters. And he's going to continue to get way, way better than he already is. And he's a great player. So I think that it was just really a good teaching moment for him, you know what I'm saying, to um, help him mature and just to understand the game more and see what he needs to get better at. That's, that's what I think, you know what I'm saying? It's nothing like getting in the game to help you see what you need to get better at and become a better player. Big couple of plays for you in the first half. Uh, just take us through your big catch down here, that's a touchdown. You know I mean? I just uh, make, want to make the most of my opportunities, you know what I'm saying? Um, as a guy that comes off, that comes with the twos, you know what I'm saying, that comes off the bench and some people, you just got to make sure that you make the most of your opportunity, really. And I know that down the field, I don't think no one can stop me in the country, personally. I don't think no one can stop me when I'm deep. So I want to show that to the coaches because they put so much faith and trust in me, and I want to show that to my teammates because, you know what I'm saying, they don't love me every step of the way, for real. So I really think that it's more so about that than the plays on the field because I've been making plays on the field since I was a kid. So that's no different than catching the go route or catching the post in the back of the end zone. It's two great plays, you know what I'm saying? It was a close game, so I'm glad that I got to make some um, plays that actually contributed to the outcome of the game. But all in all, man, that stuff happened. That stuff really is set in stone Monday through Thursday with the way that teammates support me and the way that we approach practice and the way the coaches coach us up, man. So it's really a credit to everybody else. I'm just the guy who gets to put the icing on top of the cake. Jaden, you've spoken about you've, the experience of having to be patient, waiting for your opportunity. A bit different for Jackson in the spot he's in, but. Where have you seen him grow despite, you know, having to wait till the day to really get that shot? Well, I feel like on the field-wise, like, he was uh, uh, way ahead of a lot of the people that were in his grade as far as, like, things on the field, throwing mechanics, that kind of stuff. I feel like he's really made a big jump in just maturity and, like, the mental aspect of the game. Like, people won't realize, but, like, he had a play called on that third down. It was a play call. He checked the whole play. He changed the whole play, audible to slants. Delivered a hot dot to Jalil for the first down. That almost that that basically put the game away. Yeah. What happened on that play? Explain that. He just called. He audible. Like he just audible the play. Checked from. We had a. We had some. I don't know what play it was specifically. We had some downfield play called. It was third and short, and he checked it to slants. And like that might not seem like much, but just for him as a freshman to go into the game and be confident enough to check a play from what the OC called to what he thinks is best, and then deliver on that, get the first down, and ice the game. It's just little things like that I see in him that I know he's going to be a great player. And that just shows an example of what I just said. That's one of the ways that he's definitely grown since I've met him.